I started as an intern, too, in politics. In fact, sophomore going into my junior year, I was an intern for a group called Common Cause, just by, that was what I was going to do this summer. And I happened to meet, when I was down in Springfield, a guy who the next summer wanted to run for Congress, so I said I'd hook up and I'd be his driver. That was my first campaign, realized I fell in love with it, and went from driver to finance director, but it was that opportunity of being an intern that exposed me to an individual and uh, how I got started doing political work, community work, and it was actually why when I came out of college, my first job was working for Illinois Public Action Council in the political area. So I was an intern in a summer program. It happened to be a coincidence it was in the public sector area because the truth is, while I went first to Sarah Lawrence because I was going to be a dancer, I had a scholarship to the Joffrey Ballet and I didn't want to do it. And then when I got to college, I decided I was going to study early childhood education. And about a year and a half after that, I went in and I just happened to get an internship working for Common Cause, which gave me my exposure to stuff in government work and political work. And so I would just say to all of you, this may not be your line of work, but it will be the point in which you learn responsibility. You meet people along the way that you're going to hook up with that, and while you follow that path are going to lead to other opportunities. So the financial sector is a major player in the city of Chicago. And your desire, to, when you graduate, to come back, hook up with one of these companies, continues to provide Chicago that leadership, and I think it's essential for the city. But all of us, at some point, were an intern. Every one of us. Let me say a few things about the city uh, and give you a sense of the city. Uh, first, there's basically been three reports comparative about uh, cities across the globe. Economists, IBM, A.T. Kearney all did analysis. Chicago's always rated the second most competitive economy in all of North America, right after New York. And it's always rated within the top ten, either ninth, eighth, or seventh in either one of those reports, as the most competitive economy in the world. And what's interesting about that, at least for me, is that Chicago is the only city in the top 10 that is not either the financial or political capital of the respective country. It is the number one city for corporate relocations the last two years and on track for the third year. It is the number one city where kids come to when they graduate college. 150,000 kids like clockwork on graduation day. As I often say, between Ann Arbor, Michigan, and the city of Chicago, don't get on the highway during graduation, you'll be roadkill. South Bend, roadkill. Madison, Champaign, but that's true. We have 15 colleges and universities here in the city of Chicago, but it is an, if you, according to Accenture, it is the number one city kids come to to start their career right after college. And it continues to be a drive, one of the, that is one of, not the only, but principal driver towards why people and companies continue to relocate, relocate, and expand their opportunities here. It's the number one city that had the largest drop in unemployment since the peak of the recession. It leads the country, unlike New York or LA, that are either tied to the financial or the entertainment industry. Chicago is the most diverse economy of any major city in the United States of America. No one sector drives more than 13% of our employment. So from healthcare, to transportation, to professional services, to risk management. No single sector drives more than 13% of our employment, and that gives us a tremendous advantage in the overall economy. We don't have a single driver, we have a lot of drivers. The city of Chicago, when it comes to financial tech area, is the capital for the United States in that sector. And so what you did this summer, and I hope you all think about returning to the city to make your uh, start in your career, the city of Chicago is the number one city in the financial sector as it relates to risk management and the technology associated with that risk management. And at every level of the quality of life, it's also, so you know, one third the cost of either San Francisco or New York. And so at every position, in whether it's education, quality of life, experience, universities, a start a family, is a more competitive city than some of the other cities in the United States. I think it's a tremendous opportunity you had this summer. I hope when you graduate, 
or hopefully when you start your career, you see Chicago and the industry, the financial sector, as a key to uh, a place that you want to come back and start your career. All right, guys, have a good weekend.